It was a bittersweet day in New Brighton where a beloved custard stand officially closed its doors for good. Young's Custard Stand has been family owned and operated since 1948, and we were there as customers waited in line for one last cone. Soft serve with a smile. That's been the case here at Young's Custard Stand for decades as the Young family worked to serve the community the best custard in town. My great grandma what lived in that house over there. And then it was her and my great grandfather that started it. And then my grandparents took it over and then my mom and dad took it over. Carly took it over with her dad a few years ago and says closing the staple stand is bittersweet. All of these people out here have become our family too. And we're going to miss them. Over the years, she says each scoop and melty goodness swirled together has brought her and her family closer to the community and their customers and has allowed many to create plenty of memories of their own. We've seen proposals out here. We've had many a wedding dress and a prom dress and baby's first cones and we've been a part of all of these people's lives and weaseled our way into their hearts and they've they've become a part of our heart and our family. It's good. I love it. I wish it wouldn't close. This Elwood City family has been coming here for as long as they can remember. We've been coming to Young since I've been in high school. Um, craved it when I was pregnant, so it's always been a favorite, you know, thing to do with my kids and got to make it for the last day. Got to do it. Customers wrapped around the building Sunday, sure to get their favorite scoop one last time. Black raspberry ice cream with hot fudge. Now the family says they're looking forward to what's to come with Mr. Young already planning a trip across the country in his new RV. And it's going to be really sad when I drop the blinds tonight, but I look forward to what comes next for all of us. And they were set to close tonight by 9 o'clock, but they tell us there were so many loyal customers still waiting in line that they stayed open until everyone was able to get one last sweet treat.